People are deeply anxious about their jobs, their children. 73% of people are frightened of losing their job and almost 50%, one in two of the world's people don't believe their children will have decent work. That's a disaster. So if you want to talk about mistrust and why people no longer trust their governments, even democracies, if you look at the studies that Rich Trumper quotes in the US showing that uh, only 30% of young millennials think democracy has been good for them. So we have to do something about the deep anxiety around these questions, around global power, around the realisation from people themselves that if their governments are not prepared to rewrite the rules of the global economy, and 85% of people say that, then their lives are not going to get any better. So the solutions are obvious for us the social protection floor. Everybody should have the benefit of knowing that survivability is a guarantee. That's essential services, public services, health, education, but it's also basic income, unemployment uh, income, child protection, the questions of maternity protection when people are out of work due to uh, the very important task of having a child and seeing them through those precious years. Those issues of the floor, whether it goes to income or care or fundamental services, we're not funding them. The world's richer three times than it was 30 years ago, but people are feeling poorer. And then of course wages. The OECD this week quoted wages as a major issue. If you're going to do something about inequality and about uh, the feeling of trust and security from working people. 84% of people say the minimum wage, the minimum wage is not enough on which to live. So we know that our working, uh, our working people are deeply anxious. We know that that's leading to a withering of trust in democracy, a breakdown in democratic uh, choice and uh, a fragmentation with right-wing populism that threatens the world as we know it. We must see change rewrite the rules of the global economy. Let's do something about the impending threats of climate, of joblessness, of income, and indeed of security. Wages, social protection, action on climate, and jobs. That's the answer.